According to UNICEF, Kenya is a country of many contrasts, from the landscape to demographics to social and economic inequalities. Kenya is one of the most unequal countries in the sub region. Innovation for Poverty Action, a research and policy nonprofit that discovers and promotes effective solutions to global poverty problems. Today, launched the updated Kenya Poverty Probability Index. In a sense, make it more accessible as you go. With PPI, organization can identify the clients, customers, or employees who are most likely to be poor and integrate objective poverty data into the assessment and strategic decision making. There's a trade-off between accuracy and... Innovation for Poverty Action, IPA Kenya Deputy Country Director Alison Stone started by painting a picture of the state of poverty in the world. Almost 13% of the world's population, nearly 1 billion people, live in extreme poverty. Meanwhile, OECD countries are spending billions of dollars each year on poverty alleviation, $134 billion in 2014 alone. And over the last 50 years, $3 trillion have been spent on programs to fight poverty. The deputy country director went ahead to highlight why IPA exists and the solution it brings along. The current problem, in our view, is that there is limited evidence on what works best to help the world's poor. And where evidence does exist, that evidence is underutilized in the design of poverty alleviation programs and policies. Together, this contributes to the implementation of programs and policies that may be ineffective or suboptimal, with precious funding wasted and poverty problems enduring. IPA's solution to this problem is to design innovative potential solutions to poverty problems and to rigorously evaluate them to identify the most effective approaches. Along with rigorous impact evaluation, we mobilize and support practitioners to use research evidence in their decision making, turning information into action. Together, this results in evidence-based, more effective programs and policies, and in the long run, reduce poverty. So, starting from the very basics. Representing Director General, Head of Research and Development Kenya Bureau of Statistics, Paul Samoy, pointed out how the PPI can be used in attainment of the Big Four agenda by the government. Uh, you know the Big Four. And uh, the Big Four, for example, we have the the issue of health. This is one of the methods that can be used to identify the households because the monumetric approach will just identify, will say this is the poverty level. But using this method, you can go to specific households so that you can assist them with the, with, uh, on, on health. We're saying we need questions that can produce. If it's not measured, it cannot be held accountable as the country forged towards becoming a middle-income country, then tools of measurements must be fully utilized to track the good as was the ease of doing business report, as well as the bad poverty in the country. Reporting for Brown Plus TV, I am Kara Rijon, Wambugu. Millions of dollars and a lot of capacity and training. So it's not feasible for...